Well, breaking news just coming in. An arrest warrant has been issued against Union Minister Sadhanand Gowda's son Karthik Gowda in the alleged cheating and rape case. The Karthik Gowda son of Railways Minister D.V. Sadhanand Gowda was accused of rape and cheating. A Kannada actor he had, remember, failed to appear before the police even as a second notice was in fact issued to him the notice expired on wednesday and the latest that we are in fact getting in this case is that an arrest warrant has been issued against karthik gora in the alleged cheating and rape case my colleague rohini swami is joining me live for more on this story rohini take us through the latest so the initial reports that we are getting from the police is that after issuing two notices that he come in front of the police to record his statement the absence of karthik gora and now they have the investigating officer had applied in court and, and now an arrest warrant has been issued against him. Uh, now, the whole idea is also because uh, the person, the, the starlet, the Karada starlet had also accused him of alleged rape. And right. under 376 of IPC, this after two notices, if they're not uh, if they're served and they're not responded to, they can ask for an arrest warrant and that's what has happened. Well, absolutely. And she had also, in fact, come out and accused uh, him of defaming her in the media. This was, in fact, a second uh, complaint that was filed against her. But really, the operative part of, of this is that uh, blatantly, you know, despite being an accused in this case, uh, Karthik Gora had failed to appear before the police. Even as two notices were, in fact, uh, served to him, Rohini, and the last notice expired just on Friday, on uh, Wednesday, I beg your pardon. Yes, and the whole idea is also that he was he should have come in front of the police to record a statement on the series of events that have taken place. And just after uh, interviews were given by the uh, Karada actor, uh, he, his uh, Karthi Gowda or his lawyer also moved for an injunction when, right. uh, in, order, uh, in, in court saying that nothing about this could be reported about him till uh, the court care proceedings are on. But here we see the investigating officer has gone ahead and uh, applied in court and, it, and an arrest warrant has been issued. Right. Also, uh, you know, there was an uh, anticipatory bail application that was in fact filed uh, by court, uh, Karthik Gora. Uh, but despite that anticipatory bail application, uh, arrest is now imminent. Well, yes, the, the one reason that we are getting to understand, and that is why I'm saying it's initial information to the police, is that because they are unable to record his statement in spite of issuing this, is, that is why it doesn't hold good as of now. Right. They are seeking legal opinion as of now. Well, absolutely. He is, in fact, seeking uh, legal opinion. Also, uh, Rohini, you know, you've been in touch with your sources. Has uh, the minister or any uh, perhaps representative of spokesperson, in fact, responded uh, to this particular case? Not immediately. We have not received any response from them yet. Right. But, uh, definitely from his lawyers, we're, we're soon to hear something from them. Right. Also, we're given to understand uh, that the whereabouts of Karthik Gora at this point in time are in fact unknown and a special team uh, is trying to track him down. What are you picking up, uh, uh, Rohini, from your sources in the police at this point in time? So the day it broke out, the news broke out and the case has been filed. Uh, Kat Gauda has not come out of the open except on the day of his uh, engagement where we did see him giving him all camera reaction. Right. Since then, the police have issued notices. Since then, the police are trying to track him down. And the reason for issuing his notices is so that he sits down and records the statement that has not happened. So the point is that this arrest warrant, they also expect that Kat Gauda will come in person. And then, like I said, he will also seek legal opinion as to how to take this forward. Right. Also, Rohini, has the Kannada actor, in fact, uh, responded to the latest developments uh, in the case? Well, what we know is uh, that also her, uh, her legal experts have been telling her not to uh, directly communicate with the media and it's a law it's a lawyers who will speak for them, right. for her. And so we're expecting some reaction from them soon. Uh, and I'm sure as we will report as soon as that comes up. Well, absolutely. Rohini Swami is going to continue to track developments on that story. Karthik Gora, the son of the railway minister, Sadhanand Gora, was accused of rape and cheating. The Kannada actor, he failed to appear before the police even as two notices were in fact served to him. And the latest that we are in fact getting in this case is that an arrest warrant has now been issued against Karthik Gora who is in fact missing. And uh, the anticipatory bail plea of course uh, was rejected and a special team is trying to track him down as an arrest warrant is in fact out in the open. Rohini Swami is going to continue to track developments on that story and we'll be uh, breaking information to you as and when it happens.